Is it being a toy doctor intern the best thing ever? Yeah, getting sick people of toys is awesome. Yeah, and so is playing with all the toy medicine. Speaking of toy medicine, I got a new shipment of brand new toy medicine in. Check it out, some Num Num toys, Etch-a-Sketch. Oh, it's the new For Real Friends. I wonder what this cures. Check out a Trolls Bridget wig. So many fun things, sweetlings. We're just a great creature. And here's a Rubik's Cube with Egg Baby. Oh, that's not it. A little pet shop style and stretch limo? Plus spirit surprise toys? Is this the Cindy's? I think it sure is. I wonder what these cure. We're gonna have some fun treating our patients today, girls. I hope I get whatever the sweet wing cures. And I really wanna open the Rubik's Cube, Maya. Well, we'll have to get out the toy medicine guide and see exactly what these cure, but for now, let's go ahead and put them in here because it's time for a quiz for my two toy interns. All right, let me take a look at my clipboard here and see who my next patient is. What? I don't have any patients today? What's going on here? My practice used to be booming. Where did everybody go? Let me go check the waiting room. Okay. Hmm. Not a single patient. This is so strange. All right, Addie and Maya, have you two been sending your toy medicine guide? We sure have. Perfect, because it's time to start our quiz. We're ready. All right then, so what would you prescribe to cure a case of tonsillitis? Oh, I think that was close, but Addie rang in first. A builder box. Fantastic, time for question number two. What would you use to cure, oh, this is a good one, a case of pink eye? Oh, my one that time. What would you use? A Barbie styling head. That's right, Maya, and this flip and reveal version does particularly well. Yes. Question number three, what does this littlest pet shop, Pups Unleashed, cure? I think Addie was first. Cat lips. Wonderful again. Question number four. I'm gonna get this one. What common ailment does a schnooks cure? A bad hair day. Absolutely, Maya. Maybe you should open a schnooks right now, toy doctor. Oh, uh, well, my hair's just fine. <laughs> Thanks. Well, I guess I got nothing to do. I might as well pull out my phone and watch some YouTube. What's this? A commercial for a toy doctor? Well, what in the world is that? Hi there, do you have a bellyache, ear infection, or maybe a horrible case of hiccups, but you don't want to see your doctor and get yucky medicine? Then I have the cure for you. Come on by the toy doctor. That's right, I treat your common ailments with things like pick me pop, cutie cards, and LOLs. So what do you say? I think it's time to ditch your regular doctor and come see the toy doctor. Mmm, well this must be where all my patients are going. I gotta put a stop to this immediately. Well, you two did an excellent on your toy medicine quiz. Now before we see patients today, we need to go through our toy stockpiles and check for the expiration dates. Expiration dates? What do you mean? Well, you see, toy medicine is only good for a certain amount of time, and once it expires, we cannot prescribe it to our patients because it won't cure their illnesses any longer. So what do we do with the expired toy medicine? Yeah, do we just throw it out? Well, some of our expired toy medicine will go to the waiting room for patients to play with while they're waiting to be seen, and the rest, we get to play with. Yes! Hmm, the toy doctor's waiting room. Well, I already see toys here. I don't like the look of this. Wow, she has even more toys in the exam room. If those somehow disappear, so would her patients. <laughs> oh, yep, that's expired. This is expired. Yep, this, this is expired. expired. Cutie car's no good. No, nope, that's good. This is good. More expired. I thought this is expired. I think this whole thing is expired. This is expired. This is expired. This is expired. This is expired. Let's see. Oh, that one's good too. Toy doctor 
it looks like all the LOLs are good. The don't touch me was good. It looks like the enchantments are expired. off my task. What do we have over here? Oh, LOL surprises. I can't believe she still uses these to cure diseases and hiccups and stuff. That's ridiculous. And this Hatchimal Golden Lynx. Wow, let's start getting rid of this stuff too. So which one of your favorite Bridget Cubes anyways? Mm -hmm. I think I like the Superman one. Like that one, that one's cool too. And this Hulk one's pretty cool too, the green one. I haven't seen this one before. All right, well, let's get them all arranged nicely for our patients here. Just so. Silly medicine. Let's just get rid of all this. Tangled toys and schnooks, cutie cars. Oh, this has all got to go. The LOL pets. No way. Pez. Hatchimals. All right, I can see my waiting room now. It's gonna be full of patience before I know it. All right, well, girl, you know what? It's probably time that we head back in and we'll do that other shelf and check for expired medicine. Okay, okay toy doctor. doctor. All right, back to work. What? What? Where did all our toys go? This is so not cool. Where, Where did the pick me pops go? And the yellow well surprises! What about the other shelf? Let's go see! The fingerlings are gone! And the dumbo machine! I just don't know what happened! Who would do such a thing and destroy my toy medicine practice? It makes no sense! This is so not cool. Well, I found a perfect spot for these toys. <laughs> well, I'm glad we at least have these expired toys to play with. Yeah, I suppose that's great and all, but I can't treat patients with expired toys, and I don't want my business to be gone. You know what, I better do some research now and see if I can figure out what happened. Maybe there's a toy thief in the area. What's this? A commercial for a doctor in the area? We, we wanna see. see. Okay, let's check this out. Have you suffered from a bellyache, an ear infection, or a horrible case of the hiccups? If so, don't be fooled by the toy doctor scam. Instead, come visit a real doctor. I'm Dr. Jason, and I can cure all your ailments. I use real medicine, real medical tools, and my waiting room is open. Whew. Dr. Jason must be behind this. Ooh, I am not going to let him get away with this. Have you subscribed to Tic Tac Toy yet? If not, what's holding you back? It's absolutely free. Go ahead and click on that button in the corner of your screen and then you won't miss any of our future videos. Thanks for watching.